Hello everybody, this is Phil, Kilo Mike 4 Oscar Papa, with a couple of uh, items that uh, somebody might be interested in. You're welcome to contact me if you are at Kilo Mike 4 Oscar Papa at yahoo.com. First item is this uh, book on HF Digital, a beginner's guide. Um, it was uh, written by Steve Ford. Whiskey Bravo 8, India Mike Yankee, and it was put up by ARRL. You got the information on PSK 31, RIDI, uh, GT 65. I mean, it's got tons of information uh, for people just getting into digital or, or people that are in digital that that need more information. Uh, tells you about mark shift, space, baud rate, and all kinds of uh, information. Really good uh, uh, read here. And this is put out by LRL. And you can see the price here. I don't know if you can see that, but $25.95. But of course here at KM4OP TV, you will not pay that. Um, usually you'll ship media mail, which is a few bucks. And about, uh, you know, $10. Sounds about right for this. So, here's a good one. Um, tonight's going to be a book night, I think. I do very well with books. People say, oh, people don't read books no more. They do it online. Not true. Here's another very nice hardcover. This one is all about the space shuttle, all, all about the vehicle itself. And uh, it's got a lot of, a lot of cool information, frequencies they operate on. Uh, tons of pictures of uh, the astronauts that flew the shuttle, crews of the shuttle, about the engine, about the compartments. Um, I mean, it's it's a really nice addition if you're into uh, uh, space and NASA and SpaceX. Matter of fact, we're having two launches uh, this weekend. Tomorrow there's a launch, and then Sunday SpaceX has a launch. So, a very cool book. We'll also, we'll go out media mail. Okay. Uh, the next one I got, it's the modern, modern day air power, all about helicopters, Apaches, uh, UEs, Vietnam era UEs, jet helicopters, Attack helicopter. Look at this baby. All that armament there. Really nice book. I do very well with military books. There you go. I mean, I love the, the picture. It's got some shots of Vietnam. Marine Corps. Uh, Huey. The UH-1. So, this is another nice book. That would also go uh, uh, media mail. So anybody interested in uh, modern air power helicopters, there you have it. Could be yours. Another item that I have that's really cool, and I believe, I believe this is pewter. I believe this is pewter. Um, United States Air Force, of course, picture of a, a, a fighter jet pilot with a fighter jet. I would, you know, think it would be, what does it say there? It says something very small. I would think that's something like a F-16 or something. Uh, but it's got some detail in there. It's got engraved the eagle head. This is very nice if you know somebody that was a fighter pilot, was part of a, an air wing. Uh, you can actually make a, a, a plaque, a plate with their name, maybe even their ham radio call sign on there. Very good piece, very nice. You can hang it through this little piece here or this little stand and hold it up like that. Very nice item. 
for a loved one, a friend, a Conrad, United States Air Force, says it right there. Doesn't say any particular air wing or anything like that, which is nice because it's, uh, it can be given to anybody that, that served. It's got a little weight to it. So that uh, is available. If anybody has, has interest, give me a call, give me a, shoot me an email at km4op at yahoo.com. Somebody was saying, Phil, you don't have, you said you sell all kind of stuff or you trade all kind of stuff, but all I see is the radio stuff. So tonight I said, I'll, I'll bring out a, a few items that, uh, that might have some interest. So, uh, I think, uh, I got a bunch of other, more stuff, but I think that, um, I'll just wait. One thing I do have right here that needs a little bit of work. I don't know if anybody can use this. This is a, uh, rotator housing, uh, not a, not a rotator, but a winch, a winch housing. It's rated at a thousand pounds. And what's missing is the the gear in here is missing, but you can just put anyone there. It's got a little bit of surface uh, rust, but it's not anything deep that can sand right off right back here. It's all intact. And it does have the, uh, the nut here on the side for the handle. And there's the handle, all in good shape. So if you have a, a, a winch that uh, that the housing is falling apart. All the teeth on the brake here is intact. The spring is still working. So it'll, 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 it will not, you know, you let it go, it's not gonna spin and go out of control like, like some, uh, some winches. So there you have it. And right on the side it says uh, 1,000 pounds winch. Maximum line pull. Okay, so basically, this this can come in handy for somebody that has a a winch that that just needs another housing and the uh, the spindle. I would, for lack of a better word, the spindle that goes in there. So you know something like this. Basically, you'll be paying shipping for it. I'm not looking to you know. It's just something that I have. So maybe like. Uh, you know, $25, you can have it. If I can ship it for cheaper, be even cheaper. So that's another item. Again, if you're interested in uh, something like that, km4op at yahoo.com. Another interesting item I have, look at this. When was the last time you saw a box like this? Turner Microphones. In this particular one, it's a Rode King 66. It is an amplified microphone, so it gives you a, trans a transistorized ceramic with volume control, six conductor coil. And I have to tell you, it's in pretty good shape. Um, acquired this in a trade. There it is. The Turner Road King 66, very clean. Here's your output control up here. It's uh, got a, a four pin connector. I'm not really sure what it's wired for, but I mean, it would be pretty easy to rewire. If I had to guess, I would think it was wired for a Cobra or something, I don't know. But I, I remember these from the 70s, these 70s and 80s, these things sounded great. I mean, they had really good modulation. Uh, nothing in the box, except it does bring a, seems to be a new battery for the microphone. So, nice mic with the vintage Turner box. If you have interest in, in this microphone, let me know. Let, let me know and uh, we'll make it happen. So I think that's it for tonight. Uh, for those who 
who watched my prior video in the last couple of days, I had a SG, SGC, SG230 uh, Smart Tune. I still have that. I've got a lot of offers on it. And uh, but some people just, you know, low ball offers. Um, I will take offers on it lower than I think I had it listed for 300. I'll, I'll take, uh, you know, other offers because uh, we would like, we'll like that for that to find a, a new home. And again, for those that uh, uh, are watching the videos or even on um, yeah, my videos mainly, this is, these are not reviews, my friends. These are not reviews. These are just items I'm displaying for, for anybody who might have interest to, uh, to buy it or to trade or interesting trades and things of that nature. It's just something I do that supports my many hobbies. And sometimes I just end up with different equipment. I'll trade what I have and get something else. This right here, the last item, some of you folks might have seen this already because I've had it posted before. This is a brass, looks like brass, might not be, but looks like brass. NRA Golden Eagles. Got the eagle there, very nice belt buckle. That's what it is, a belt buckle in very nice condition. So it's available. So that's about it, people. Thank you so much for viewing my videos. Like and subscribe, but you don't have to. You can just uh, watch the videos in Condino, and if you see something you like, email me and uh, we'll we'll talk about it and believe me I'm pretty reasonable and uh, we'll get her done. Seven three for now. Stay healthy. KM four OP signing.